breast cancer rehabilitation. Today let's talk about the low level laser. Now I've spoken about it in previous training videos and what I want to do today is show you what it looks like. So Rianne Corp low level laser. So it is a handheld device and you use it on skin, so on the tissue and it's an invisible light. So if I turn this on and the sound is because you can't actually see the light. So it's an invisible light and it penetrates through the skin. And what I've found is that it has a good result on scar tissue. In fact, there's good research on this particular low-level laser. There are studies on, on animals, so rats, and their healing after surgery. And there's, in fact, studies on, on women after breast cancer and particularly with lymphedema. So I'm going to go through both of those. So the interesting ones with the surgery on the animals is that they've been able to then compare the difference between using low-level laser and not. And what they have shown is that after using low-level laser, it must change the scar tissue. So what they've done is they've injected dye into the lymphatics at the site where the scar was on the, on the animal. And on the animal that had no low-level laser, the, um, the blue dye went to the, to the scar line and then bled out into the tissue beside it. In the animal that had low level laser, then the blue dye travelled to the scar line and then continued on, which means that the, the lymphatic vessels were able to rebuild. So the scar tissue was soft enough that it, the tissue was able to, the lymphatic vessels were able to re-establish themselves. So that's pretty exciting. Uh, for the human studies, then they looked at doing some uh, low-level laser on women that had had uh, lymphedema. And they compared that to uh, using a sham device. So they actually had two groups and they used, because it beeps, they used the same instrument but actually took out the, the, the light on, on the control group. So both groups of women thought that they were getting low-level laser. And the interesting thing was that three months down the track after the treatment is that, in fact, the lymphatic um, measurement showed that there wasn't much difference between the control group and the treatment group. And so what they did was that they repeated that. So a couple of months down the track, they did it again. And in fact, what they found what that was that there was a significant difference between the control group and the treatment group. But this confirms that what was most likely happening was that the treatment group, the scar tissue, does take a while for it to improve. And, and by softening up the scar tissue, then more fluid can readily flow. So that's the low level laser and I just wanted to introduce you to what it looks like. So contact your breast cancer center Ask if um, they have a low-level laser within their, their treatment premises. Um, if not, then I would suggest that you look on the Rianne Corp website. So that's low-level laser. And if you're interested, please subscribe because you can then find these videos as they come out. And uh, if you have some other topics that you might like to understand a bit better, then please leave a comment down below.